Someone will say that all these weapons are old, but, in fact, this equipment has been repaired and modernized. Therefore, it is in excellent condition. In addition, local defense engineers have developed a large amount of ammunition that dramatically increases the firing range. But it is known that the GHN-45 can hit targets at a distance of up to 39,000 meters. Iranian gunners have been undergoing combat training for a long time, counting on the possible superiority in the air of a likely enemy, because they pay great attention to camouflage. In addition, they have guided precision-guided ammunition and drones capable of correcting fire. Speaking of guns Hoitzer, about 120 GHN-45 guns remain in service with the Iranian armed forces. Originally a product of the Space Research Corporation, the GC-45 is a towed howitzer designed by the renowned artillery designer, the famous Canadian scientist and artillery engineer Dr. Gerard Bull. It has served in the armed forces of several nations since the late 1980s, and its design has influenced many artillery pieces developed since it first took shape in the mid-1970s. The GHN-45 is, in most respects, similar in appearance to the Belgian GC-45, but has been redesigned in certain key areas to improve both handling in the field and reliability, and to make the weapon easier to manufacture. The carriage uses a walking beam suspension for improved cross-country mobility, and a secondary float is fitted for easy emplacement, displacement and general weapon handling. There is a quick release in the traversing gear that brings the barrel from the traveling jackknife position to the firing position in a few seconds, and there is a steering device that allows the weapon to travel in the tracks of the towing vehicle. The GHN-45 can be airlifted by a Lockheed Martin the 100-130 transport aircraft without preparation, and the normal towing vehicle is a 5 or 10 ton 6x6 six six truck, with the traveling speed on all types of terrain limited only by the capabilities of the towing truck. The GHN-45 can be delivered in a basic towed form, or with an APU, an APU kit can be supplied for fitting to towed models by the user. The main power source is a Porsche 236 6.94-cylinder, 4-cycle air-cooled 2.3-liter engine delivering 120 horsepower. The APU is mounted on the forward part of the carriage with the driver on the right. The APU enables the weapon to propel itself at a maximum speed of 30 km per hour, and two 30-liter fuel tanks provide sufficient fuel for ranges of up to 130 km. With the APU the weapon can climb 40% gradients at a speed of 5 km per hour. From 1989, Noricum manufactured an improved version of the 155mm SRC International GC-45 155mm gun howitzer under the designation GHN-45. A total of 12 of the original GC-45 systems were provided to the Royal Thai Marines. Noricum assembled all but two of the 12 guns, two six-gun batteries, supplied to the Royal Thai Marines, and then began deliveries of over 600 guns to various customers. In June 1987, the Thai cabinet approved a purchase of six GHN-45 weapons at a cost of USD 7 million, all of which have now been delivered. These models are fitted with an auxiliary power unit. No figures for Austrian production of the GHN-45 have been released, but it is estimated that between 500 and 600 weapons were produced with production reaching 10 weapons per month.
Production by Voist Alpine stopped in the late 1980s when it became apparent that the weapons were reaching the Middle East. This 155mm high explosive base bleed, heat BB, projectile was developed specifically for use with the Norikam GHM 45 155mm towed howitzers. About 120 GHM 45 guns remain in service with the Iranian armed forces. This came at a time when supply from overseas sources of the extended range full bore ERFB, projectiles intended to be fired from these howitzers became, at best, problematic, or, at worst, impossible for Iran. The Iranian defense industry has long been manufacturing various items of artillery ammunition, so it is likely that the overall form of this HBB projectile was dictated by local industrial resources rather than by ballistic considerations. Even so, this projectile can attain a maximum range of 32,000 meters from a 45 caliber barrel. Apart from the details provided here, information regarding this projectile is limited. This projectile is produced by the Ammunition Industries Group, a MIG, of the Iranian Defense Industries Organization. The bulk of Iranian field artillery is in 155mm caliber, so it seems likely that their production of the associated ammunition has been substantial. The projectile can also be fired from the hatted 155mm HM44 Thunder II self-propelled cannon, which is a 39 caliber barrel. The 155mm ERFBRABB BLAP, projectile belongs to new generation of very long-range artillery projectiles designed for importantly improving operational range performances of a modern towed and self-propelled 155mm gun, howitzers with 39, 45 and 52 caliber barrel length. The projectile design combines rocket motor and base bleed units in single projectile, 